ever swallowed a mouthful of ocean water and instantly regretted it? It tastes like liquid regret. But if rainwater is fresh and rivers flow into the ocean, why is the ocean salty but rivers aren't? And more importantly, what would happen if the ocean suddenly became fresh? Would it solve global water shortages or create a new disaster? Let's dive into the shocking truth behind this salty mystery. Where does salt in the ocean come from? First, let's get one thing straight. The ocean wasn't always salty. Billions of years ago, when Earth was still a chaotic rock floating in space, the first oceans formed from volcanic steam and asteroid impacts. This early water was fresh, just like rainwater today. So, where did all the salt come from? The short answer, rocks and time. Wait, what? Yes, the ocean is salty because of rocks. Here's how it works. One rainwater erodes rocks. Rain is slightly acidic because it absorbs carbon dioxide from the atmosphere, forming weak carbonic acid. When this rainwater hits rocks, it slowly dissolves minerals, including sodium and chloride, the two key ingredients of salt. Two rivers carry these minerals to the ocean. As rivers flow over land, they pick up these dissolved minerals and dump them into the ocean. But here's the twist. Rivers don't taste salty. Why? Because their salt concentration is too low to notice. 3. The ocean acts like a giant salt trap. When river water reaches the sea, the water evaporates under the sun, leaving the salt behind. Over millions of years, this process has turned the ocean into a massive salt storage tank. 